welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Cross. Okay, that's a little too much. All right, this PS One. It's not analog unless I set it ahead of time. Um, I thought the idea to get the code was to talk to this guy or like get behind him somehow. Somehow I found it up here of all places. That uh, eight to the right, six to the left. Eight to the right, six to the left. Okay, I guess that's my clue. Him looking at it there and then moving over. I thought it was him guarding this. Uh, it makes a little more sense. Why'd they write it on a friggin' wall? I don't see a paper or anything, or maybe they inscribed it or something on the side, like a hidden brick somewhere. <laughs> I don't know how I did this my first time, playing this myself. I got way farther than this. I don't want to say how far yet, because... Huge spoiler! Do-do-do-do-do-do-do! Still can't get in friggin' doors. Jesus. This flu's really bad. I mean, it must be. I've had it for like a... How long now? For like a week or so? Oh, there's more shit here. I'm trying to see if I can actually like open the thing or if I'm just like that badly off. This flu's... It's a pain in the ass ass. Whoa! What the shit is going on here? The two planets are colliding. Or is that like the moon or something? Whatever it is, that's a damn cool shot. What's going on in the air? There's a person here. Don't want to walk around it. I want to look at this thing, if anything. It's even the map makes me... Why is it turning around now? It's not going where I'm pointing him at. Alright, who you is? There's someone up there, too. So, like, what are you doing here? Dragoons aren't allowed up here, you know. We're not really dragoons. What are you talking about? Uh, you sure that's wise? So, like, what's your point? What is it, Marshy? Is someone there? Some weirdos. Marshy, lower the ladder. I'll switch right there. One moment. Oh, he's faster than I thought he was. Didn't know you were allowed in here. You must be—you must not be one of the dragoons. Looks like one of the sages with that that uh, cape half hanging off him like that. You must be Carl. I have you've grown. Like, can I kill him yet? Patience, child. I've not have a word with these people. Who are you, and how do you know Carl? How do I explain? I guess you could say I am the... Oh! It is! Well, there you fucking go. Well, there's not a single entity in another world similar to our own exist in another dimension. Is that what's happening outside? Them two big fucking uh, moons or planets or whatever? That them colliding outside? That's just happening outside when no one's... <laughs> what is that? What is that supposed to be? Simply unable to see if you're experiencing it. But I can, I guess. Uh-oh. What's happening? Uh-oh. Flea's gonna try and jack our shit again. Ten years ago, something happened that put your very soul teetering on the balancing scales of fate with a 50-50 chance of life or death. This is when your future was split in twain. Your homeworld, you survived to live a happy and prosperous life. That's how you made it to this present point in time. Here in this alternate world, you are in fact very dead and buried. Ten years ago, but this world's timeline has flowed on regardless. You are but a ghost brought back from the past here. I don't know what happened ten years ago, nor can I guess what triggered your entrance into this world. Locations where such divisions in time-space continue to occur are called Angelus Arare, where angels lose their way. It is said that there, the borders of two dimensions fluctuate in such a way as to make the passage between the parallel realities a possibility. Perhaps in this world you are a missing piece from a giant puzzle. Maybe the vacuum created by your non-existence here has drawn you across the border between the dimensions to fill the void in that puzzle. Eh? However, it appears as though these two worlds are connected by an unknown force. Depending on the location, the two worlds influence each other in strange ways. I'm quite certain there's a wormhole that connects the two parallel worlds. For your information, if you press the start... Huh? 
Didn't know that. Homeworld or another world select on to display this. Huh. If what you say is true in this all world is alternate. Why did Carl die? The reason has to be something that happened ten years ago. I can only find out by moving on. No way I'm gonna let you. Who are you? Can I? Can I? I guess it cannot be helped. This may be fate in itself. We do not have the time for your silly games. I advise you not to take Marcy lightly. This child is... Oh! Damn! Well, it's a boss fight. Careful not to damage the books. I hope I'm ready for this. I'm not granted, but I still don't really get anything except a fuck ton of uh, magma bombs. Take this! Don't kick my dog! She, she. Wow, I was about to. That's about to really date myself, but uh, she, she come to my house and and uh, she, she attack my party and and she kick my dog. She kicked your dog? I don't think so. She's lying to you, fucking guy. Shit! How long ago was that on the internet? Oh God! She's going in. She's going in. She's going ham. She come to my party and she kick my car. I don't want to do magma bomb. Maybe a, maybe just the cannonball do. I don't know what element she's gonna throw out there, if any. Uh oh, and that. Put me at disadvantage because now Tom's the only one and his is kind of slow to get out there. Whatever I do with him, I gotta get the uh, Kanus back. Got to plus three. This ought to do some damage. 71, that's pretty good. I made a count. Think you're so smart? How about this? Cat's Cradle! Uh-oh. Uh, did that do anything to him? I didn't see points of damage, but maybe it slowed him even more. How would... Ooh. Ooh, she's almost down, though. Might as well use ours and top us off. Does it? Ice blast! Well, I got my other heal for that. Oh no, she's not done. Should I save that recover all? Maybe. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Shit! This ain't good. She's almost dead, but what the fuck do I even do now? We had watch it cause I could have done that. Make this count. Okay, good. <laughs> that could have been a problem. It's freezing one of my uh, heavier hitters. Another level, though. So, make the fight worth it. Another level one for Carl. A lot more HP. Stats all around for Tom. No extra watcher call. It's still more stats, though. Another level one for Canis over there. Just a little bit of stats all around. Only enough to cure uh, one of us, I'm afraid. Got an ice blast offer though. That might be good for one of us, considering how devastating it was for to hit up, be hit with. Friggin' froze Canis. I 
I did not think you would be able to defeat Marcy. Very well, I shall advise you of your next step. Eight pillars standing in the main hall, behind the second to last, so the seventh pillar, on the left. Actually, let me write that shit down. Okay, second to last pillar on the left. Dragoons are not allowed up there, so it is best that you go up as you are. Beware, there is a much stronger being you will encounter. Yeah, I kind of figured that. Wait, that one almost dropped us. Second to last on the left, okay. Was there anything up here before I leave? Double check real quick. Can I access that ladder? Is it still down? No, it is not. Wait, she had a switch down here to lower it. Okay, there we go. Now I can climb this sucker. Turn white. That's all that was up here? Well. Wow. Treasure's treasure. Okay, that was to the left. Oh. Hmm, maybe we only get one chance at this, because Kai just suddenly stopped us, and this person was sitting out here. She wasn't here before. Harlequin. Hmm, you are Carl? I think you had a French accent before. You're even more sexy than I thought. Ooh la la. And who the bloody hell are you? And this vulgar one must be Kai. You disgust me. What'd you say? You can insult someone, you better at least speak proper English, you twat. <laughs> oh shit, I'm sorry. Whoa. That's what happens when I go too inside with an accent. I don't say that, girl. <laughs> I may say fuck a lot, but I feel like... Even I have my limits. Je m'appelle Al. I am the right hand Queen to Monsieur Lynx. Carl, mon puce. Lie down with a dog with this film, you will surely catch the fleas, no? I think you can do bad better here if you give her up. Actually, I suggest you all turn back. You could not defy him. Oi, what's your problem? Please, mon Carl. I would hate to see anything hard up to you. I don't have to with you! Tazez vous, you shut up. I'm having a serious conversation with Carl. You mind your own business. That's it, put up your dukes, you're going down. I'ma kick your ass on your kiss them double moons out there. You saw him too then, huh? You are the one who is going to have your derriere kicked, non? But alas, I cannot be caught fighting you here. I imagine the trouble I would get into. Au revoir, mon car, see you again. Please dream of moi, oui? Does Carl have a clown fit? <laughs> Renoa wonders aloud. <laughs> uh, does this mean you're back with us? I meant to maybe switch you into something, perhaps, but maybe just you're just going off on your own. It's just gonna be a thing for a while. Uh, maybe I want to check this out first. I already fought this, so we'll be skipping this. Oh. Oh, maybe not. Okay. So that was only the one place to go. Well, I needed to heal after that uh, last battle, so thanks for the impromptu one there. Just dropping that on top of me. Important guest upstairs. We have strict orders not to let anyone through. Oh, yeah, I just noticed we're not in disguise no more. Wait, the pillars, the pillars. Let's get the last pillar on the left. So it must be neither this one or this one, the second to last. There we go. Oh no! <laughs> I wasn't sure if that was a thing that was going to squish, or am I going up another... What do you think you're doing? Oh! Let's get this too, because these are the guys we've been fighting down here. Hey, we're finally going to get out of this damn dungeon. I feel like it's been, what, two, three weeks now? Thanks for the free photon ray. Alright, let's do this. So what button do I hit now? Oh, I got to sit in the thing. Switching the armrest. There we go. Jeez. This is game mostly so I can get rid of the goddamn flu. Would have thought this would be the most aggravating of uh, what you call it I'd have to suffer from. Not to uh... can I sneak past the door and try to open it? Not with the flu, I can't. Jesus, I tried to walk up. It goes left. Whoa, that's a new enemy it's sent out. Wraith. Just 
cut him down if I can. Five and still standing. But the right plus and still standing, excuse me. Wait, why did... Whatever, I'm gonna hit both with the Witcher Con anyway. Hopefully it drops one of them. It didn't. Oy. Well he's almost done. So is the door too, but unless summons after it. There we go. Okay. Wasn't sure if the Wraith was going to pull anything off like a... Nasty little... Special effect that I can't heal right now because I don't have items for it. It could also be a thing I get in the future. I don't think I'm spending my money on anything else right now. Wraith drop anything special. Just a leather. Well, now I can get in this door if the fucking game will cooperate and let me do it. Are my controls, re like, weirdly reversed or something? Well, now I'm going left and going slightly left. That looks like the frozen flame to me! Nah, it ain't the frozen flame. I don't see any other boot either. Pass the general directly. Ooh, a secret passage. Oh. What is it you wish to ask me? My compliments on getting past my security. Now may I ask you, who in heaven's name are you? So you, General Viper, don't fight ignorance on me now. Why'd you send your dragoons to get me my collie? Carl, my dragoons? I'm afraid, my dear, I haven't the foggiest idea what you're talking about. General. I believe these vermin are here to see me. Moot my partner, Puss and Catman. It seems you've saved me the trouble of finding you. Lynx! Uh oh! I thought I was gonna teleport and then. Oh, I guess not. Are you? What's the matter, cat got your tongue? I finally caught you, bottle tail now, Lynx! I've come for two things a frozen flame and ye life, you murderer! So you must be Kai. Then a member of the fearsome band of thieves known as the Radical Dreamers, correct? Radical Dreamers, this young lady. Precisely. Don't let her innocence fool you. She's quite ferocious. Ferocious? My ass! After what you've done! I hate to disappoint, but the frozen flame's not here. The fire lies hidden in the Sea of Eden, the place where past and future collide. Oh, thanks for the tip. Have to put that part off till later. In the meantime, I'll set me score with you. Prepare to meet your maker. Are oh, you teleporting piece of shit? I have no business with you. I'll fight this main party over here. So if you can do that, like, blanking out shit, does that mean I can't hit him either? This is going to be one of those fights where it's like, oh, you have to lose. I don't know where to find out. I can hit him. I go for broke here. Just looking at this guy makes me think a uh, black element. So let's get rid of that right quick. Oh, yep. Damn. Well, good thing I got that off early. Cause I can't use it now. What's this in my way? Pillar or something? Probably not gonna do that. Uh. Nah, you know what? That's just gonna power his stuff up later with the black. I'm gonna put healing on him then, if that's the case. Canine ball. At the same time, gotta push that black out now. Doesn't power it up any further, if I can help it. Imbecile. 
Oh, it turns you into one. Magic temporarily increased. Okay. Or decreased. Blah. I can't even do it now. That Not at all. Make my bomb plus one his ass then. 29 show. Was it never with the Witcher cards? Better stick to that then. Drop my magic now too. Well, if that's all you're gonna do, I mean, that's fine. I thought that would, like, drop him. Or at least make him, like, hold himself to us, like, oh, he's, he's almost done. I got this sinking, sinking suspicion because he keeps ma casting that black stuff. He's uh, trying to power up something. Wow, that didn't do shit. That's right, he's been powered down. Hell soul! Yeah, that's what I was just afraid of. Cast them three black what you call it to power it up fully, and then this does like crazy damage. Oh miss. Ugh. That's what I was afraid of what that looked like. Like, here's my instant death attack. That might have actually worked had I had like what you call it out there. Well yeah, he he's got two, so that's what made me so nervous. There he goes. Now he's using the sickle. Ooh. Oop, now he's... Okay, he's... Dodging everything now. Nostrum. Crap, he healed himself. Oh my, what's your call's back now? You do your thing and heal everybody. Before he casts a spell and uh, brings that whole field effect on his side. Oof. Wow. Eight plus two. Oh, that trucked him. He's still standing though. That was a good chunk though. Continue to open his ass up. There's Anti White again. You seem to do the most damage, so cut him. You're wrecking a shit. Is it because your element's white or something like that? That might be. That might actually be the thing. Like even your attacks, like do a number on him. That might be why he hits Carl so friggin' hard too. That's what I'm thinking. Like the inverse, black and white are weak to one another. Yeah, cause he's the mage. He took like. Comparatively to Carl, like next to nothing. Yeah, be careful, Carl can't eat much more of those. Better keep Kana's up there so she can heal. Gotcha! There we go. That's gotta be another uh, level. So we're gonna get even more shit now. Boom! Oh, I got a plus two that time. Still nothing for Tome. Don't tell me because of flu he's not getting this. I'm gonna. That's gonna upset me. Pendragon Sigil C. Bug, it was a shadow. Not his true self. Do you think I'd be stupid enough to pick a fight with a rabid dog? Just a shadow of mine is enough to deal with the likes of you. Now, Carl, what do you desire of this world? You wish to live again? Erase your demise from the pages of history? I just want to know what the shit's going on!
Listen to me, the end of the human world is nigh. When this time comes, Carl, there shall be a deep enmity between you and the world. Not speculation or prediction, it's history. More shadows! One for each of us, I... They stand look good. You cannot escape. There is something I want to ask. Daddy, about that voyage of him... Oh, oh my. Oh shit! Don't move a whisker or you want this girl to live! Goodness, who are you? My darling Riddell, you dirty. Shut up, old timer. Our lives at stake here ain't nothing dirty but saving your own life. Just stay calm and quiet. I won't hurt you. I need you to come where I still will reach a safer place. I'll let you go out there, I promise. You alright? Call this boss out of here. Well, that was convenient. Can I heal now? We still gotta get away, I guess. Don't be foolish, you really think you can escape? We are blocked in. You fiend, take your dirty hands off Lady Riddell. Oh, okay. What are you taking me for, an idiot? Car, this way. Hey, slow down. Not all of us can float, you know. You leave him alone. He's got the flu. Isn't real shit going on the flu nowadays? Oof. We have you now, your vermin. There's no way out of here. Bloody hell! Let's work out a deal. Release my daughter and I shall let you walk. How about it? Yeah, Roy, can't trust ya. Your name is Viper! Like, doesn't exactly feel good. <laughs> You want to jump to your death. I'll do it. I'll jump. I've got a choice. Ooh. Watch out! Oh! Guess you really didn't have a choice. Shit! Took that long with the shadow, the real thing's probably gonna truck us if we fight him. What do you know? Come to me, Carl, the assassin of time. Oh! Oh! The Chrono Trigger is the assassin! Well, our flu's gone. I can save, right? I think that's what they're pointing me to. Yeah, okay. Let's do that real quick. You're finally awake. If you're looking for your friends, they're outside. Hey, I'm not zigzagging around anymore! Yay! What's up here? No, no, not that way. You go this way to get out. Sorry. It's not that I don't know the way, it's just that I want to know always! Every way! Oh, Korcha, you brought us here, probably. I was, yeah, that's right. You waited for us. Good job, buddy. Oh, God, you finally woke up, eh? Give you thanks to Korcha. He's the one who saved us after we fell off the cliff. No sweat, just part of my job as a ferryman. Gotta admit, it caught me by surprise you came falling from the sky. Yeah, no kidding. Lucky it was the sea that you fell into and not the rocks. Ooh. Hey, a bit closer, it would have been the cliff. G -g 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 How could you get knocked out after a short fall? A little graze like the egg going to. Wow, can't believe Kai's fucking dead. 
No. <laughs> you did get stabbed. We just fell and... Maybe it was a poison dagger, possibly. I thought this next thing's gonna be probably. Gotta save her! Gotta save me from this poison! Or I'm knackered as fudge, am I? Blech. Seems the patient's been poison. Yep, called it! Two days. And some Hydra humor we could be able to neutralize the poison. I wonder if we have to go to the marshes to get that. We'll find this humor. Can we save this girl? Yes, but that's impossible now. Hydras now exist on El Nido. We mean extinct. What's going on? Hydras are very rare and valuable creatures. This blood, bones, meat, every part's valuable. Considered to be a panacea for various illnesses. Reason Hydras were hunted to extinction. The most terrifying species of all, man. If there's no other way to find this tumor, we could cross the sea to the mainland. There might be a chance, right? Not possible. The currents of El Nido are extremely dangerous this time of year. Highly improbable to cross the sea unless you're on a large vessel. Even if you manage to get there, your chances of finding a Hydra humor are bleak. We don't have much time. You can't give up. We're our Poochoo protagonists. Hey, Doc, where are you going? Nothing's been resolved yet. Excuse me, I need to be alone for a while. She's just bummed you can't do anything. Carly Poo, what are we gonna do? Kai's gonna die if we roof her like this. Is this some kind of joke? I'll get the doctor back. Whoa! Who the hell are you? What's this? No apologies for bumping into moi? Ooh la la, don't you know any manners? So you followed us, huh? She's down for the count, just as I thought. Why are your pants see-through? Do you not have legs? Some kind of weird Jenny clown, Jester? Come on, Ami, why don't we just leave her be? Who are you and what's with that strange costume? Zeter, I have no business with no chicken hawk. <laughs> I'm no chicken hawk. Don't you call me a chicken hawk, you chicken hawk. I'm having conversation with Carl. You're bothering me, so shut up the face. I'm not gonna let you barge into this room and get away with all the stuff you said. You made me mad. I'll show you matters. I'm not gonna cut you in this just because you're a girl with no legs. Try if you dare. I'm not so weak as to be caught by a chicken hook. Got some nerve. You're not gonna regret it. You're gonna regret it, actually. Yeah! She pulled that disappearing shit, too. There's some creepy extension of Link, sir. Maybe just know the same tricks he does. Such a simple tanny, so much fun playing jokes on you. I was only here to see how bad she was doing, but I had fun while I was at it. So long, Carl. Au revoir. Dream of moi every night. Oui. Mwah. Oh. Ho, 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 ho. Saloon. What's her deal? I don't get it. Yo, Carl. You're all your friends like that? Uh. Well, Liam's trying to probably kill me passively and directly. But we don't talk about her. Oi. Carl. Ye. Go. Shh. Right. Um. Nakodaim. I'll leave this with you. It's my favorite amulet. You're holding out on me? I feel a bit tired. That reminds me I get that other thing to check the sigil. Gotta rest up for a while. Could have done that in the menu. Shit. Yeah, what the duck said, no more Hydras in this world. On top of that, there's no way to get to the mainland, and El Nido isn't that small a place. Gonna take a one in a million chance to search for this thing just to save a girl you barely know? Hell yeah. Hey, what you gonna do? Hey, you, what you gonna do? Well, of course I'm gonna find a way to save her. Sorry, I had to go take care of something real quick. Alrighty then, I'll come along with you. Corcha joins the party. Or maybe just as my boatman. By the way, you have a clue where to start looking? Hey, do you? 
That's what I thought. Where in the world would we start? Like I said, that whole uh, swamp thing. Just because there weren't something there before doesn't mean there's anything there now. If only we had some kind of clue. Um. You know something? Maybe the shaman might give clues onto that amulet. That's right, the shaman. A shaman? That is an unfamiliar word. Shaman inherits the power of the dra dragon god and governs the village. There's like a mayor chief. The shaman might know something. Although I can't say for sure. It's worth a try. We'll continue this outside. Let's discuss what to do with the boat. That was weird. It was a shadow at first. Don't trust it. What the hell's going on? Is Carl seeing this or are we all seeing this? Well, he didn't see it, so that's one of my assumptions is. Since we are the uh, main protagonist, we're seeing this as well. I'm trying to figure out what the hell's going on. What's up? Just a cat. Strange guy. Come on, let's get going. What indeed happened back there? That thing reacted. Need to get going as soon as possible. You probably need to equip yourselves, right? I'll be waiting here. Come when you're ready to go. You haven't got much time, so hurry. Need to see the shaman? Go down this way. Take the ladder to the second floor of the merchant tower and go left. There's a tower called the Dragon Shrine. Compared to Terminus, a small village, so you shouldn't have... Oh, well, thank you. I didn't get too lost in Termina. I, uh, well, I didn't get lost. I just kind of didn't see that whole portion there at first. Welcome, Chapel. Changing materials for extra elements here. There, I got rid of all those uh, tablets I've been holding on to. It was like, I had like 80 of them. I'm like, okay, I can get rid of these and trade some things for materials I don't have. Something might come up. Got a favor to ask. Save this bone from a trader, but I'd like you to set it adrift from the sea. I'm sure it's a real honor. I'd like to have it returned to nature. Yeah, no problem. Maybe it's one of the bones we're looking for. Pelvic bone. Yeah! You need guts to get through life. Hey, that's right! My favorite dish is Terminus' favorite squid gut pasta! Isn't everybody's? Seems like a common thing around this part. Equipment essential to protect yourself from danger. Times like these when you need the latest goods. I'm still just an apprentice smith, but my passion for work is golden. Let's see what we can do. I got a leather. I'll boost a... Breast rod. Yep. Cool. What? Have that? Nope. Got one. I gotta equip it in a separate what you call it though. Without armor. Right, what's that thing I picked up? Shift attribute of element attacks received to weapon only. Low levels. What? Hmm. I have to look up what that exactly does later. To the left of us. Did they say this was the shaman? The demi humans in this village get along with humans, but many others of our kind still hold a grudge against humans. Those that were driven off the mainland gathered to build the village of Marble, the big island way down southeast from here. Sorry to be abrupt. Have you ever crossed a shiny material? Hmm? Elements are common nowadays, but there's a special kind called summon elements. This kind releases awesome power depending on one of the six attributes. The shiny material is a mysterious byproduct of this phenomenon. Essential for crafts in the forge, advanced weapons, armors, and accessories. Still, everything depends on the skill. So that's another thing to keep an eye out for. Old customs lore might fade away with time. Uh oh. Lynx did say the world was uh, getting screwed over while the human race was. But we want to check down first. There's the dock. Another life about to slip through my hands just like before. Nothing's changed at all by studying medicine. I'm so powerless. So you're just going to give up on this life? That's not the case, is it? You don't who also help her back from the edge of life and death. I don't know your past. Living bound by the past, a very painful thing. You need to face reality head on. Running away isn't a sin, but it accomplishes nothing. But I... One thing's different from the past. You have the ability to heal. Everyone in the village recognizes that. Don't suffer by yourself. 
Give up now, you'll never be freed of your past. Don't let it end without doing something first. I've done them in discourtesy. I'm a failure as a doctor, but I must do what I can. Thanks, Orla. Throw that booze away. Oh yeah, just break my shit. You know, I don't need to pay for that or anything out of my own pocket. Oh, that was pub. I see. Okay, they're having a moment. Let's not disturb them. Even though as a JRPG protagonist, that is something you could totally do. This looks like it says shop. There might be more stuff in here. Small village, we got some rare elements. Okay. So let's pop a... Pop a peep. Let's see what you got. Let's get 10 of each of those just in case. So I'm going to cut my pants down again like I was back at the... Ooh, that's another new one. Hell Soul. Time to remove soul, the soul from foe's body. I'll take two of those. I'll take three of each. Thank you very much. Please be careful when traveling the seas. So, man of the sea, you gotta be on your toes whether you're land or manning the ship. I must pay close attention to my element placement. Gotta think about terrain and attribute conditions, so it's pretty complicated. Cat does nothing. Far from the eastern Il Nido, there's marble, homeland of demi-humans, but my friends there hate humans. Yeah, if they saw what's going on in Terminator, they wouldn't be too happy. It's racial discrimination, I tells ya. This is the residential tower. To the north of this village lies Earth Dragon Isle, which we locals call the land where the dragon sleeps. So a few years ago, the surface was covered with sand, but somehow the sand disappeared completely overnight. I was back where I was. Can I go up now? Yes, I can. That's where I started out as. Is that a thing? That's not a thing. There's a thing out here. Just talk with this person. You around here, right? Know what these wires are here for? You don't know, I'll teach you a special price of 5G. Uh. That's just gonna take me down, but, uh. Why not? Quick run down to the whole gadget. A wire connects to the docks. Also, a second wire connected to the shrine. Basically, a shortcut to the docks. You can get there a whole lot faster than walking. The problem is you can't come back. Can't fight of gravity, you know. Um, so you're gonna let me do this or not? I have to pay 10 to get you there. I can just cut out that way. Unless that's the only way to get to the other place. Ooh, there's a down, too. There's Mel familiar. Don't you bother me. I gotta concentrate and concentrate. Now we're back out here. Oh, no. This is new. That's what the Watcher Call it leads. I'm assuming let's go all the way back down where Korcha is. Back where we started. So let's go to the left of that element shop now. See what's out here. This looks like the shaman place. The Dragon Shrine, residence of our chief, Shaman Dureya. Be sure to act courteously on the premises. Would you like to become like the wind? I won't. That's too bad. There's a safe point over here. Uh, can I use that first before I talk to you? I'm going for a while now. Okay. I am Stuna, Shaman serving the village chief and high priestess Dureya. I presume you've come to the shrine seeking assistance. Please don't hesitate to ask Chief Dureya for guidance. Uh, can I do that later? Really gonna make this tickle that one? You possess a young but gentle air about you. There's an odd wind swirling about. I've heard of such wind bearers up here at times, but... Do you speak the truth that you are already dead in this world? I see. So that is why you have an odd air about you. It's because you're dead. It's for a way to return, I don't know, but there are always reasons why such phenomena occur. The land of Genesis, your only key may lie there. The key that connects your world to this one. Shall we say it is a dimensional distortion of sorts? Oh no. It's Zelia 2 all over again. If events in your world are different from events here, it may be possible to save the girl stricken with the Hydra poison. That is, if the extinct Hydra still exists in your world. Aha! So I gotta find the means to... do the thing, get back to the other world.
most famous are the island of the Sky Dragon, the Earth Dragon, and the Water Dragon, and the ancient ruined Fort Dragonia that lies to the east. The many Dragonian ruins, Fort Dragonia is one of the few that's still fully functional. The key to activate this ruin is the Dragon Tear. It was given to our ancestors by the extinct Dragonians as a symbol of our friendship passed through the successful shamans, but... It was stolen and taken from Goldove by an unknown assailant. Their intent is unknown, but they plan to activate the ancient ruin. A great disaster shall come about. Our people have been searching for it, but we found no trace. You're just gonna tell me the same thing? One must choose their own path, but as long as we're human, one will sometimes become lost. I pray your journey is blessed by the guidance of the six ga dragon gods. I pray that I'm blessed that I don't have to cut this out too heavily, or I can at least fit it in one episode, because all that was was like a boss fight and then get to hear for more things, so... Uh, I guess we'll meet Korchat back at the boat since we're all prepared and we'll set out for sea wherever we're going, where we're going next time on Let's Play Chrono Cross!